And your story, Alan, I mean, in 2013, um, you were just 22 years of age, and you went public about your experience and uh, experience with depression. It was, I suppose, a new step. You were probably the first GA player to ever do something like that. Let's hear your story. Um, how long have we got? <laughs> um, 32 minutes and 34 yeah. seconds. <laughs> 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 no, like my story, it's I went public in 2013, and at the time, I certainly was the first active player to, to, to go public with an issue. There'd been other guys that discussed issues probably when they retired and were reflecting back on dif different spells of their lives. But I suppose I sort of had a conversation when it was still, I was just out the other side of it, but I probably wasn't, I was still sort of in it to be honest. Um, but no, I trace it back to 2011, I was playing for Calvin in another 21. All Ireland final, and we were beaten that day by Galway, and we'd won an Ulster campaign. It was just a great time as, as a young as a young man. It was something I dreamt about doing for a long time, playing, being with a group that I'd grown up with. But I suppose in the aftermath of losing that final, and we've talked about resilience there. My resilience, my resilience skills are more or less nil point. Um, and over the course of a couple of months, I really just lost my way. It was, I suppose I wasn't articulating how I was feeling. I did the stuff like going drinking and you know going out, trying to just mask all that stuff again. Like sometimes we're we feel program to do as young males, but look, I cut through it all and get to the, the crux of it. But by December of 2011, so it was six months after playing All Ireland final, um, I was lost by it with depression and was having suicidal thoughts. And I had a very, I suppose, the way I always describe to people is there's, there's suicidal thoughts, there's suicidal feelings, and there's suicidal actions. And that's how the sort of process would. I would categorize it. And that was the first day that it ever became close, to, it was just very close to an action. Um, and lucky enough, it was a wake-up call for me, and I was able to go and have a conversation with my mom. Um, and from there, I was then brought into services, so it's actually I was brought into a counselling program, 